Okay, this is a, a curl squat variation with either one kettlebell or two kettlebells. So you can do this from V footing, from I footing, from A footing, or W footing. V, A, W, V to I. Okay. The more narrow your stance, the more challenging it's going to be in terms of your structure. A lot of times we want to cheat by going wide. So I can have my one kettlebell here. I'll pick it up like this to start with. This is eight kilos. It doesn't need to be very heavy. And then I'm just playing around in here. I can hold. Breathe in. Breathe out. I can also hold here. Elbows are on the thighs. Some more open posture. Curl it more rounded. Weights on my heels here. So I could be in the eye footing. Same idea. Really staying connected. What's my spine doing? Like downhill skiing? Well, sorry, tucked here. I could be in all these different levels. More open here. And then when you need to rest, drop it down safely and shake it out. Try never just to bail out. Now I'm going to show you with two kettlebells. And I'll go in the, I'll go A stance. Here to here, so I'm using my thighs, my elbows on my thighs here. This is the snow plow position, the braking position in skiing. Pizza. Breath in, breath out. If you want to bail out, ooh. it's going to work you. Yeah. You're trying to get spend as much time as you can in there. Now W footing. So I can start with the kettlebells on the ground, set my stance, elbow, elbow, and then I'm here. I can use this back behind me as well, like a seat, and come up off it. So I should be more rounded here. Whew. This should be more relaxed. I can tip, twist my pelvis, turn, and then try to get deeper. W footing, weights on the heels. Weight can be more on the balls of the feet here. Elbows. Everything's working together. This can be a rest position, or it can be super active if you're more up here. So if your hips go below your knees, it's more of a rest for your thighs. If your hips are above your knees, your thighs are working super hard. Booty's working hard all the time as well. So it's a curl to squat variation, all kinds of different footing. One kettlebell, two kettlebells. You can use dumbbells as well, so enjoy. Rock on, spend more time deeper, and you're gonna get stronger. Stamina, you're gonna be able to catch yourself, absorb impact much better, and then you can release it through power, right? Catch and release, and then uh, eyes closed. You can do so many different sensory uh, performance challenges. And then we flow. <whistles> Breathing first.